All right, my friends. Uh, I've cleaned the clutch and the clutch, the clutch and the clutch drum. I'm just putting in an insulation or a piston stuff, insulation stuff. It goes back to my carpentry days, right? Spilt a little water here. Not gas. Trying to drink more water. Now, I'm putting in this insulation insulation stuff. That's so easy for me to say. Because I was a carpenter's helper for years and years and years. I was so crazy I took my vacation and worked as a carpenter's helper. So now I'm going to screw this down here, right like this. You'll see it right there. I'm screwing this in until it hits the piston. There. Now depending on the direction of travel, that piston's not going anywhere. Good, I think. Now, we have the plate in, and I have, I took the other one apart with this in mind. The recession goes in here, and I made, I made this little socket for this exact purpose. And I'm just going to get a half inch socket, half inch ratchet for the socket, and it's reverse thread by the way. I'm just going to back it up the other way to see if it, yeah, no, that's right, she's hitting the stop, so that's cool. Okay, and you can see right there the collar of the clutch is close to the shaft. Right there, isn't that a cool shot? So I guess this goes on next. Nope, we got a we got a bearing in there. That goes on top of there like that. And I think I only need one of these. Let's do this one. Is it smaller? Yes, it is. And then there's a nut and a another washer, but I don't know if we need it. Let's put it. No, I don't think we need it. I feel like I'm missing something. No, nothing will fit back there. Well, that one will. There we go. That one will. And that one will. Okay. So there's no choice. This washer goes here. I think it's... Let's just have a look at the marks on it. Yeah. And then this, with the the uh, bushing slash bearing, and then this big guy goes over here to that one, and this big guy goes here on this one, is that even possible? Yeah, it is. Is one bigger than the other? Mm, no, but this one's a little more concave. Oh, we'll use the flat one. And then, we have a little one on there? Yes, there's a mark of a littler one. Or oh, this one might be forward. Yes, if I'm not mistaken, it is. Right on, baby. Now, what size of... Is that a 5 eighths again? Five eighths. Okay. 
going to turn this over and it's going to hit the stop again. Okay. Oh yes, and while you weren't looking, I, I put the dogs on the front. Imagine that. So now we have a we have a dilemma. Muffler. Well, muffler and bar, right? So uh, let me think about this. Good. That goes on there like that. And muffler. We have two choices. We've got. We're getting somewhere, guys. We've got this muffler, right? Which is just a run of the mill garden variety muffler. Or we've got the hot rod muffler, which came off the C51, right? Now, I think they're both going to take the same bolts because I'm not going to get crazy on it. Looking, I'm a looking, I'm a looking. These are a special kind of bolt, too, eh? Oh dear. Well, that answers the question. We're not going to put the hot rod muffler on today. <laughs> we put this one on. We put this one on. We put this on. Oop. <laughs> okay. Are you guys watching this? I'm kind of over here now, a little bit. And, uh, all over the thread does. Now there should be one with a slightly stockier load. I think. Quarter inch. Yes. Is there a small law for that baby? Eh, maybe, no. It's just the muffler. So I'm going to just do this for now. You old telephone men are going to perk up on this deal. Is that a quarter inch thread? Yes. I'm running out of stuff. I guess I can take that plug stopper out of there. Perfect. I don't think I marked the piston. Okay, I think, am I going to need to put a, I don't think that's going to fit. I'm talking to myself here. <laughs> it's hilarious. Good, it tightens up. We don't want to tighten it up just yet. We want to put these guys on. Good. Now, oh, and they got holes in the top. That's right, too. These are, I read online that these are hard to find. And long. And three eighths.
Good. Now, we got a couple of burnt looking 1224. Shorter 1224s. There, there's one, and there's two. Okay. Mufflers on. I may, I may modify this muffler because it's just so ultimately cool. We'll see. Now, where's the hammer? If I had a hammer, I'd hammer in the morning. I'm just gonna tighten up a couple of these. Gosh, you guys, are we getting ready to put the bar and chain on? No way! So now we just have to figure out which one of these. Uh, I think. Does that go there like that? Yeah, I think it does. And I think that one. Let me just check my diagram on that. I actually have a diagram for that. I'll be right back. All right. So for my diagram, both the... That might have to turn around. Both of these guides face the top. Does that line up? Yes, it does. You know what? We're almost ready to put a little bit of chain oil in this bad boy. Here's the bar. I'm not, I'm not in love with this bar. Oh, and there's seven, there's seven uh, stars on this clutch, which means it's a 404. So if you take the chain, and measure between any three of these okay well you gotta look down now guys this is it bar education time so if you measure between any of these three links in the chain that is how they grade the chain and we'll start at one inch and it is just a little bit more than three quarters. So that is a 404, just from the research I've done. Gosh, I just, I wanna clean this up a little bit. I really am not happy with this bar at all. It's weird looking. I was told it was a, whoa, yay. I was told it was a, a bar to cut railroad ties. So I'm just going to stop here, clean up this bar a little bit. We'll see what we can do. And we'll put it on. All right. Well, I'm starting to run out of bolts and nuts. I'm glad I got a few longer 1224s around. And I'm going to cheat on this one. until we get the other two on. My selection is getting thinner and thinner. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the other saw. I want to say thank you to Leon's. Uh, well, this is going to work. Good. I want to say thank you to Leon. Leon's Chainsaws. Homolite is what he specializes in, which is what this is. Good. Okay, handle on. Let's just move this up and see if we can still move. Okay, guys. 
And then on the secondary thing, I just thought I'd bring my polisher out. Ah! Woohoo! And you can see how far I've gone. So I'm not going to go crazy like I did on that old, uh, what was that? Was that a partner or a pioneer? For my, for my pal, Francis, and anyway, he, he was the source of these saws too, eh? until I'm done now you're getting the idea okay we're getting so close I decided I'd better put the handlebar on I'm stunned I don't have to take anything else off to do it there look at that and I've got I believe five or six one two three maybe even only three so let's take the prettiest ones they're stainless steel Good. I'm probably going to buff this handlebar too, eh? Okay, let's... is that a 9 16th? Let's just see. I think this is 7 16th. That's 5 8 You guys are watching, right? Yeah, you are, by gully. Okay. Just do a sneaky on this one. It must be a half inch. Ah! <laughs> oh, God. What a klutz I am, eh? Yep. Half inch. Good. Now we're just going to tilt you on your butt. I better not do any more than that. I could be bending them. Okay. Now that's a nice handle because it goes all the way around, eh? Oh, we're getting close, guys. Chain. Outside chain guard. Uh, chain on the bar, and I've got the bar shined up pretty darn good, huh? Like this is an old saw, and it looks like it's spent most of its life with this piece at the bottom. Because look at that, it it uh, sinks down that far, and that doesn't. So this is our new bottom, and you want the chain to cut the wood. You got to put it on this way. Well, I guess I could start it over here. All right. Now let's just use the drill to hold that up. I don't know if I've got any adjustment there or not, guys. Oh, ha ha! Is that going to work? Is this hole going to be big enough? Not quite. Okay. So what the problem is now is this hole is smaller than that hole. So I'm just going to have to turn the bar around. You getting any of this? Let me move it over a little bit. We just have to turn the bar around because this bottom hole is the adjuster. This is the exciting part, you guys. I'm not going to fire it up today. I think I'll wait for my buddy Steve-O to come over. Because he's younger. <laughs> you know what I'm thinking. Okay, let's just see what we got here now. Oh, 
Oh, I missed it. Dolly, dolly, turn. This part goes on like that. Can I do it? No. On like that. On like that. On like that. I'm gonna drill this bar out, but I wanna just see if it see if it's capable of going around and around, eh? There we go. think so. They look like five eighths to me. Yes they are. Okay, let's just get it close. See if we can adjust that chain up a little bit. What does it use? A screwdriver? Yeah, it does. So now we are going to see if we can adjust that devil. Yeah, it's adjusting. I'll be darned. It's a little catchy, but we won't worry about that right now. Extension. I wonder why it's catchy. What are we rubbing on? Ah, looks like we're missing a piece of something. A shim or something. on this tomorrow. Oh, I'm tired. Let's just loosen that off a tad. Maybe we're just a bit too tight. There. Okay. Good. You just never know how things line up, eh? Tighten that chain up a little bit. Too tight. It works very well. Okay. It's a bit loose, but uh, we can we'll work with it.
Good. Okay, my friends. One last thing, and I didn't want to put it on now, but I have to. You won't laugh at me. Are you still co are you still uh, watching sort of kinda? Yeah you are, aren't you? on there for now. I'll put this back. Okay, I think that's 99% of the... Okay, can I be honest with you now? I want to paint this home light, the embossed white. The green that's on the other side. green that's on the other side comes on the air filter a little bit and so that'll be cool and then the decals I've got all the decals for it look at that folks I'm gonna take it outside and take a picture of it holy crap is that a heavy saw 